Ensuring a well-organized presentation of your products on your store's page is crucial. Hence, in this video, we'll demonstrate how to effectively showcase products on your online store using SP Page Builder 5. Start by checking if you have your product list ready that you wish to add to your storefront. Then, navigate to SP Page Builder Pro from the components and choose Easy Store. This will take you to the backend editor of your shop page. Choosing and expanding the Easy Store option from the sidebar will also land you on the storefront's backend editor. Once there you can start adding and editing your add-ons according to the layout of your shop page. For today's tutorial, we will create a simple layout to display our created products. Let's start by adding a section. We're adding a customized section arrangement with a 3 plus 9 orientation and this will divide the section into two columns. In the first column, we are adding a div add-in first. Inside the div add-in add two more add-ons, search and filter. In the second column, add the product list add-in to display the created products. Now inside the product list add-in go on and add the information that you would like to display with each of your product items. These can be the product's titles, images, add to cart button, badge, prices, and more. For this particular demonstration, we are adding thumbnails, category, title, and price add-ons. Save the changes and let's check our layout so far. This is how your shop page will look like initially. Now go back to the backend editing interface and click on the product list add-in. From the add-in editing panel, locate the category option. From the drop-down list, assign a category of products that you had previously created. All the categories you have so far for your shop will be displayed in this list and you can choose which category of products to display on your shop page from here. Next, go on and start personalizing the add-ons according to your layout. Firstly, we are adjusting the add-ons in our first column where we want to display a search filter. For the search add-in, we are customizing the add-ons text color, titles, typography settings, padding, borders, and margins. Adding a search option to your shop page minimizes the search time and enhances the overall shopping experience for your customers. For the filter add-in, we're adding a few filter items. These filter options will expedite your users' searches, enabling them to quickly find the precise items they are looking for. The filters facilitate searches based on criteria like prices, product availability, product types, and more. We're also revamping the add-in style, incorporating changes to typography settings such as fonts, text size, line height, and text weight. Don't forget to add changes to the filter add-ins borders, margins and paddings, and colors related to texts and borders. Save the changes and let's have a look at the result. The search filter looks perfect. Next, let's customize our second column. We will adjust the add-ons look individually. Editing the add-ons entirely depends on what your layout demands. For the list of the products, we are just adjusting the add-on's text color, titles, typography settings, padding, and margins. Once everything looks fine hit save. And that's it. Your shop page is ready. Customizing and showcasing your Easy Store shop page with SP Page Builder is as simple as that. In our next video, we'll show you how to create and customize a single product page with SP Page Builder. So stay tuned for more tutorials on Easy Store.